Hi everybody, it's Lisa here. Um, I am going to start a YouTube channel. Don't mind me, I speak a lot with my hands, so I'm gonna try to not do that so much, but sometimes I just can't help it. Um, I'm not really sure where this is gonna go. Um, I would like to just, I don't know, share some of my stuff. Um, I'm not what, I, what you would call a makeup guru but I just recently kind of become addicted after watching some of the YouTube channels and um, some of the people that I'm subscribed to, like uh, Super Freaky One Are You is like, she's kind of my inspiration, I wanna say. Um, but anyways, um, so today I am going to show you a box from um, The Village Sampler. And um, basically what they do is they send out things that are handcrafted items by people who make jewelry and um, soaps and candles and um, tarts and just all kinds of stuff. Um, basically if it's handmade, they, the people send in samples and then the village sampler sends out a big box of stuff. So I'm going to start by um, showing you what I got here comes in a big box like this and um, inside the box you can see that very well is a, another little box like a cake box it's really cute and just so you know I already have peeked in here because I have no patience and I just can't wait I love surprises but um, in the box came on the top came some samples and this month's theme is called beach bum so they're kind of beach inspired most of them are beach inspired items and um, it's just fun stuff. So the first item on the outside was the edible stuff and they sent a apple crisp caramel. Looks yummy. And this is by the sticky wrapper. Um, excuse me, I got really bad eyes. And I think you can find them on Etsy. And they have a Facebook page too. And then the next sample is, it's called Do to Do love the name and they are little candies and it is whoops lemongrass flavor sorry not used to this yet and they have a little coupon in here so i can go to their website and use that and they are also on they have their own it's called my doTERRA d-o-m-y-d-o-t-e-r-r-a dot com do t do so I don't know if that's another. Oh, and they also do have dotido on Etsy.com or dotido, dotido, I suppose. That's how it's pronounced. So that looks nummy, little hard candies. And there was also this. Uh, it was a rub. Um, it was a barbecue rub package of spices, and it smells really good. The problem is, when it was in the bag or in the box, rather, it overwhelmed everything in the box. It was wrapped separate from all the other stuff that was in the box but it seemed like everything i smelled after that no matter what the smell smelled like the rub so i kind of had to set it off to the side and i may or may not show you later so i don't know i forgot it over there so i'm gonna open up the box really pretty it's got a little first i, I was like okay my husband is an engineer in the national guard <laughs> and that's what this looked like to me it looked like their engineer symbol but then i realized well duh it's it's supposed to be a sandcastle because it's a beach bum themed. So duh, I figured that out. And this is really pretty. And these are just separate. I thought they were all one, but they are so pretty and they do such a nice job of tying them. So I'm gonna open up the box here and this is exactly like it looked like when I put it all back together. And here is the, on the top, it talks about um, the beach bum and the sampler, the sampler box and the village website and you can go to samplervillage.com and get your own and this month's mayor they have a mayor every month and it's like a shop and they sponsor I think they put I, I'm not really sure what it consists of but anyways this month's mayor is Dolly Pop Cosmetics and uh, there's a little thing in here about craftcafe.co for the cafe browsers and for the cafe seller I suppose you can go on there check that out and it came really cute. She has this in a little, um, a little plastic bag. It's got little flip flops all over it. And then she dressed it up with little foam stickers or foamies. 
and um, that's really cute too. It says Dolly, Dolly Pop Cosmetics on there. And then you open it up. She has her cards. She has a little bit, a little bit of confetti in there. Um, she has a scratch and win, so I get 25% off code when I go to her website. And let's see here. And she has what looks to be bath salts. And those smell good. <laughs> they don't smell like rub anymore. And it's Beachy Keen bath salts. Mm, they smell good. I might have to fight with fight for my oldest daughter for those because she loves bath, bath stuff. And she put a little piece of candy in. Oh, piece of candy. Can you tell I like Family Guy? And then she also put in a little, it's called Be, Speci Be Pacific Dolly Pop Cosmetics. And I believe it is, I don't know if I should open this. Uh, I will. Oh, it is Blue Mineral Eye Makeup. It's very pretty. Got a little bit of dust there. And then it's got candy and some confetti. And I will open it up underneath the yellow tissue. I was so excited to get this because I've seen other people on YouTube opening up their boxes and seeing them and I haven't I've had a couple other sample boxes of crafts and this is the first one I have gotten that finally has the Blackbird Soap Company sample in it. I was so excited so I haven't opened it yet. I smelled it. Sorry. Take another there real quick. And this is the Blackbird Soap Company, and they ha do have their own website. It's called blackbirdsoap.com, and it is pa pala Ooh, it's a creamy body mousse. Pala I'm sorry, I can't pronounce it, but, oh, it smells good. It's got a little bit of a beach smell to it, definitely. Mm, reminds me of the beach. It is called Best... Oh. Oh, and it even has an expiration date. That's kind of cool. Best before 10 of 2012. I'm sure I'll use that before that. And the next thing is by Pixel Wix. That's P-I-I-X-L-W-I-X-I-X. And it looks like a tart. It's called Good Vibrations. Ooh, it's you, pineapple, jasmine. I love jasmine, love pineapple. And I love tarts. So this would be good. Oh, it's not a tart. Silly me. It's a candle. Oh, it's so, it smells so good. Oh, I love that. I'm going to leave it out so it smells up in my room. And the next one is Mommy, You Soap It. And these look like where Mommy, Kids, and Soap Meet. Cute. They have little fish and a little um, starfish soap. It says soap, do not eat. And crystal blue. Mmm. Oh, it smells good. So glad it doesn't smell like that rub anymore. So glad. Okay, and this next one, ooh, is a lip balm sample or lip gloss, perhaps. This is by My Lip Candy, and it is. Can't read it. Something. I don't know. Anyways. Oh, it smells good too. on but I'm just too vain for that and I can't see what it says sorry next thing we got a lot of stuff in here so I hope I don't take too long on this is Orange County Candles and it's, it's a soy tart melt and the name of it is butt naked cute it's a little fish I'm gonna have a hard time melting that it's so cute oh it's not fish Silly me. It is a shell. That oh, smells good. I never knew butt naked would smell so good. The next thing is looks like bath salts or something that you maybe put in the bath. Oh, kind of got all over here a little bit. The Scented Princess Cupcake Candle Melts. Uh -huh. The Scented Princess. And this is Rockin' the Stars. Place desired amount in the tart warmer and enjoy it. Ah, oh, it smells good. It's kind of perfumey, yet kind of fruity. Oh, jewelry. I like jewelry. 
this is um, a wrapped hemp bracelet from the openroadartshop.com. Pretty. Isn't that pretty? Pink. It's wrapped. It's got a little button hook. And they also sent in this just little calendar. A little pocket calendar or a little one you can put in your wallet. And again, it's the open open road art shop. The next thing is Earth Magic Egg Essence. Oh, it's detergent. Oh, I can't open it. I don't know if I can open it. I can smell it. Oh, I can. Mmm, it smells fresh. EarthMagicEssence.com. It says use one to two tablespoons per load. You can use a little more for hard water. It will not make many, if any, suds and can use it as a pre treat. It's nice. Earthen Magic Essence. Oh, made me sneeze a little. Oh, it's making my nose itch. And this next one is from Aqua Blossom Handmade Beauty. You can go to aquablossom.com. Um, and they also have a Twitter you can follow. There's a coupon on here, and it looks like this. It looks like, I'm not sure what, oh, it's a body scrub. Oh, yum, 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 yum. This over here. I don't want to separate anything in case I decide I want to buy from them later, and I won't know who comes up with a little stick. is beach bum. Yep, it's called beach bum too. Hmm. Oh, it kind of leaked. Okay, I will put that back. Okay. Sorry. It smells good. Ooh, this one is a full size soap. It's from Create a Spa. I don't know the name of it. Don't open this one up. Big, huge bar of soap. Lavender scented, which I do like lavender. Even though some people think it's an old lady scent, I don't happen to think so. Or maybe it's just because I'm an old lady. Oh, it is create a spa oasis in your own room. Bathalicious.com. Oh, they and, the, and it's got all their lists, all their scents on here, which is awesome. I hope they say what they smell like. Because sometimes, you know, they, they'll say, oh, they'll give their own special name, but they won't say what it smells like. Ooh, they have a lot of similar sites to Bath and Body. Oh, they also have name brands like Ed Hardy, Jean-Paul Gaultier, Polo. Mmm. Oh, that smells really good. And this one is from Good Girl Gone Bad. A handmade glass lamp work pendant. I love the name of there. Like good girl gone bad. Oh, and they got the little E that goes in there, so good girl gone B. Cute! Just, people are so creative. Oh, what a pretty little box. And they've even got their little GG, GB on the cover. Oh, this is pretty. And I saw this already, and I have to say, this is so creative. See, I make jewelry, but I don't do anything nearly like this. It is. I don't know if you can see that very well. It is a little beach or underwater. Whoops. A little underwater scene. It is so cute. I know I'm going to be wearing that. I just love that. So creative. I hope I have a coupon. Ooh, I even got a coupon, so I might have to check that stuff out because that is just super cute. And the next thing is... Maybe I missed it. Oh, just a couple of cards. This one is a cute little card from Little Kitten. And she has a little kitten. Oh, shoplittlekitten.etsy.com. She also has a Facebook page. And this is all love it. All of it. All love it. Like, all lo I love it, maybe. I don't know. Party favors and gift baskets. And they've got a site on Etsy, too. And oh, this is really pretty. This is a card, a handmade card. Isn't that pretty? Oh, 
I am a special friend in need, indeed. Cute! And they make a penny for your thoughts. Handcrafted all occasion cards, gifts, and accessories by Penny Brooks. She's a principal par partner, and you can find them on Artfire. That is so pretty. People are so talented, I tell you. And this is from Canadian Detach. D-stash, excuse me. I love D-stash. Um, getting D-stash off of Etsy, and then I make whatever I want to out of it. And she's got like little um, pieces of paper. You can make cards. Um, there's a little, I guess you could make this into a little thank you card. It says grateful. So that's really cute. And this next one is from Marilee Jane Design. It's Etsy.com. It's Party Pop Pop. Com. It's just if you look for party pop pop under shops, you'll find it. And this is super cute. It is a vintage looking cupcake. What do you call it? Just you know, a, de a cupcake decoration. So you just poke in the top of your cupcakes. So cute. Love vintage stuff like that. And here is another cupcake. Somebody knows what they're called. Tell me. I can't think off the top of my head what they're called. What they are. This one's another one, and this one looks like it's kind of sealed up. This is from Earth County? Earth... Well, anyways, it's from Giggles... A... Giggles? APU? Etsy.com. And it's a little flag that... Oh, it's from the Earth Cookie. I think they make cookies. I, I, I think I've seen them before. Got just a little poke for the... Again, cupcake. And this one is from Darling Girl Cosmetics. And... And they've got two little samples of mineral may. Oh, three, excuse me. This one is, darling, this one looks like eyeshadow. Maybe eyeshadow. And that one definitely looks like eyeshadow because it's kind of a green, or not, it's kind of a grayish color. So those are pretty. And she's got her little sticker in there. It says, that must be the Darling Girl logo. And she's got lots of cards in here. Cute. Cute, cute, cute. And the next one is from Tara Biddlespocker. Biddlespocker? Biddlespocker? B I D L E S P A C H E R. Throw this little book in your bag and be ready to keep your little one occupied. Oh, cute. Find me on Facebook. It's a little coloring packet sampler. I don't want to open it because it's just so darling. And the next one is All Things Colored. You can find them on the yardseller.com on Zibit 2. And this is Christine Williams. Wow. This is super cute. I guess you could use this as a card or maybe put it in a frame. Isn't that cute? She did. She must have drawn this. Must be like a little print because it says CW. So Christine Williams. <sighs> Not done yet. The next one is Autumn Rose Bath and Beauty, inspired by beautiful little things. And it looks like, I don't know what it is. Oh, Almond Shea Butter Hand Cream. Ooh, I want to open it, but it's wrapped up so nicely. I don't know if I dare. Oh, what the heck. It's got the name on it, so I'll just rip it open. I love to smell stuff. Everything smells really good so far. There isn't anything that I don't like. Even the... Oh, it smells like almond. That's good. Even the rub smells really good. Even though it smelled everything up in the box. That's okay. It's okay. And scented palm wax tart from Southern Cross Candles. And that's what their name of their website is. SouthernCrossCandles.com Enjoy your free sample and we hope to see you shopping with us soon. Ooh. Oh, it smells good. I don't know what that scent is. It's very kind of floral, but fresh. It's a very fresh scent. Oh, Chanel number five. Oh, lady I work with loves Chanel. She says that's her classic scent. And this next one is, oh, cute. <laughs> that's a little tiki. 
tiki head. This is Toes in the Sand Soy Blend Wax Tart. Mmm, smells good. Cute. And this is from Skinny Dip Soaps. Some people are so creative. I'm just not creative for anything. And this is from Mammy Graham. And she's got a little smiley face. I think it's a magnet. It says, Cards and Gifts for All Occasions. Tracy West. www.marygram... Excuse me. mammygram.etsy.com I smile because you are my sister. I laugh because there is nothing you can do about it. No, I don't have any sisters. I just have two older brothers. And this one is Sleepy Poppy Shop. Pretty packaging. And... A little soap. Oh, it smells good. What is that? It, it doesn't say. If it does, I can't read it. Oh, that smells good. I don't know what that is. It's kind of fruity. It smells like food, but it doesn't smell like anything baking because I don't like cupcake scented stuff or cake scented stuff. And this is from the Soap Cafe. These are soap shells, and they are orange chocolate. Cute. They look just like shells. So cute. Oh, for cute. I just had to throw a little Minnesota in there for you. And then it says, come visit us at soapcafe.com. Mmm, smells good. And these next one, kind of getting down there finally. These next ones are, oh, this must be wax tarts and this the smell is watermelon oh I do like watermelon and they're little flip-flops and little sunglass shaped tarts those cute oh I like watermelon. and coconut almond and ginger all natural soap and this is from Michelle's this and that dot com you can find her on art fire too Oh, that smells good. Oh, coconut, almond, and ginger. I guess I can smell the ginger more than anything. And this is from Bugs and Bubbles Seashell Soap. My main squeeze soap company. Cute. I don't know if that's the name of it. Anyways, that's cute. Here's another... I've got another scratch off here, and this is from bonniebubbles.com. And, oh, I better use that soon. It expires in July. Oh, cute! She has... Oh, for cute! She has... a little sample of perfume in a bottle cap. How cute is that? The, sm the scent is a flirty... It's a flirty cream perfume, and it does smell good. Fruity with playful floral, giggling in the <laughs> background. Wispy heather, pink grapefruit, bergamot, fresh ylang ylang, and a slight drizzle of jasmine. An overall juicy, fruity, floral brightness to the senses that's simply fun to wear. It smells good. And this one is from Beau Savon Fray at Etsy.com. B A U. B-E-A-U-X-S-A-V-O-N-S-F-R-A-I dot Etsy dot com. I think I'm pronouncing that right. Bon savon freight. And I don't know what the scent is. Oh, that's good. Oh, apple fritter. And it's soap. It's hot processed lye soap. Okay, now that's the one that takes a long time. Cook it up the lye and all that stuff. Mm, berry Berry. This is from six white ties .etsy.com. First I thought it says six whiteies, but it's no six white ties. Luxury handmade soap and such. Oh it doesn't really smell like berry, but it does smell good. And this one is from Goaty Girls. It's goat milk soaps and lotions. Let me show ya. 
an oh, solid perfume stick, also available in low profile round pots. This would be cute to just stick in your purse and your makeup bag. And the perfume is fresh ginger lime. Okay, I've got a free hand here, so I'll do this other hand. Oh, I like that. Oh, I like that a lot. It's very fresh. I love lime scented stuff. And here is um, custom, custom printable party designs from, um, oh, I want to show you the Goody Girls Goat Milk Soaps and Lotions. Isn't that cute? Um, I'm sorry. This is custom printable party designs from Dilbert, Dilberto Photo and Design.com. Just a sample pool party circle that you put in a cake or on a cupcake again. Oh, and we are finally down to the bottom. Oh, two more. Uh, this one is cute. It's a little flip flop. I'm assuming the scent is sun and sand because that's what it says. This is from Soaps and Stuff, handcrafted soaps of the highest quality. Oh, what the highest quality. And you can find them on Etsy. And this is coconut oil soap. I like coconut oil. Mm, I don't want to open it because it's just too cute. And the last thing in here is from Soapy Sue's Bamboo Sugarcane Hemp Oil Lotion. Enriched with avocado and mango butter. Oh, I bet that smells good. And it's paraben free. That's from Soapy Sue. There we go. Dot com. Cute. Okay. Well, that was everything in my box. Guess it took a little bit longer than I thought it did. So, um, I'm probably going to do just a couple more, um, one more, one or two more reviews, reveals, whatever you want to call them. And then I got an M scrape. So, um, I'm going to sign off and you'll see me in the next one.